It takes courage to overcome a disability and a lot of heart, and in one dog's case, some brotherly love. Cat Villanzoni introduces us to a sled dog who hasn't let his blindness stop him from keeping up with his team. If you see him in action, you can tell Gonzo is meant to be a sled dog. Here we go! Gonzo's so cute, he just like throws his head in the wind and That's he's just wagging his tail and he's just, he's just along for the ride, he's such a ham. But sudden illness threatened to take him off the team. Three years ago, Gonzo went blind in the span of just a couple weeks. Treatments didn't work and no surgery could restore his sight. His future as a sled dog was in limbo. We kind of went to our vet and we said, what do you think? And he said, run this dog, you know, just take him out, see what he does. He looked excited to go. Here we go. Up, 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 up. So we did. We harnessed him up, slowly reintroduced him. And over a span of about a year, he reintegrated into running with the team because he wanted to. He was very sad when he got left behind. Good boy, Gonzo and Poncho. A solution developed when Gonzo's brother Poncho became his seeing eye dog. It was a process that took time. When Gonzo began to lean into Poncho at first, that's when he would get frustrated. But he began to allow that as he realized there was something different about his brother. And with that realization, Gonzo's future as a sled dog didn't seem so far-fetched anymore. Um, Poncho might lean into him, nudge him, bark at him. They've developed a system of commands far beyond what we could teach. Well, if they're back there, you know, it's kind of cute. Poncho will even give Gonzo a little nip on the side of the face like, hey, bro, hill's coming up. Though Gonzo and Poncho work quite well as a team, they are trying to make Gonzo comfortable with other dogs. That way he isn't too dependent on his brother. Whoa. But if something were to happen to Gonzo's brother, we want him to feel like he can stand on his own two feet and be confident. Gonzo's neckline yep. also helps keep him running straight, but his brother has his back when Gonzo's blindness lands him into trouble. Gonzo stepped, literally fell off the trail into the deep snow and went poof. Um, the story goes, Poncho literally leaned over and on the X of his x back harness, grasped it with his, his front teeth, got him up, mid-stride they kept going. And their wagging tail of inspiration has given his handlers a new perspective on disability. We perceived him as having a limitation, so we might have been more hesitant. Are we ready? But for the dogs, the sky's the limit. He said, okay, I'll adapt. We'll keep going. I mean, you know, I figure if I was blind, I'd rather be out running, doing something for fun than just sitting at home, you know. They told us that as long as this dynamic duo wants to pull sleds, they're not going to stop them. Cat Villianzoni, Channel 3 News, Bretton Woods, New Hampshire. Muddy Paul Sled Dog Kennel also has an active sled dog rescue and adoption program for other dogs. You can learn more about that on our website. We have a link in our info center. Well, that is an inspiring oh, story. That's great. And Gonzo and his <laughs> friends certainly don't mind the snow. No, they don't. And uh, that's probably the way to get around these days is dog sled.